Hey, what's going on everyone? My name is Chris, this is my wife Kathy, and we have another What's Old video for you guys today. And look, we're back in the mm -hmm. storage unit today. We have a busy week, but the kids are in VBS this week. So they're off doing that. We're gonna start picking what sold for us over the weekend. It is Monday morning, so good morning. Good morning. <laughs> Uh, there was one thing that was at the house. So I just brought it to show you, which was the Sorrel sandals. I just listed them, I think maybe Saturday, um, and they sold already for $47 with discount shipping on Posh. So someone accepted their Posh or VA offer that went out. Very I bought nice. those for $12.99, so hey. nice, nice profit. There. Very nice. Yeah. All right, so I did separate my labels by side just because I feel like that we have like 35 up to 40, something like that. Pretty decent weekend, yeah. yeah. Let's make it go a little quicker. All right, I sold this Pottery Barn. It's just a, a pillow sham, so nothing crazy. I got it from the bins up in Denver. My cost of goods that day was $2.58 per item. Um, it's over 12 with discount shipping, so not huge, like a $5 profit or so. But okay. Yep. I'll take $5. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> super easy listing. All right, A-Y. Passing it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 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 All right. These are just some Clark's, um, like a suede Chelsea booty. I bought for eight ninety nine, sold for thirty eight on Posh. That was an offer someone sent me. I accepted. Very happy with that. Yeah. A Q. This was a pair of my son's Riley and Crew swim chunks. I bought them off Kittizen for 15. He wore them last summer, sold them for 20 on Posh. So I'm making all my money back there. Okay, BV. W. Okay. Right there. Right, some Clark sandals. Um, I bought for 10 just a few days ago. These sold within like a day or two of being listed for 31.11 plus shipping. So I'm not too bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, I like Clark's. I'd consider that a very bread and butter brand for me. VBB. <laughs> B. <laughs> VBBB. <laughs> uh, this is another item that sold super fast. I want to say within a day of being listed, some Doc Martens. These are the Solomon sandal. Um, I just bought these a few days ago. I did pay $30 for them at a thrift store, but they sold for $79 with discount shipping in, like, like I said, a day or so. Um, about a doubling of my money there. Very nice. I'll take that any day. <laughs> Who does not want to double their money? <laughs> right? These also sold really fast. I listed these, I think, during our live on Thursday. And they sold this morning. So, um, Cork Ease sandals. Bought for $10.99. Sold for $44.46 plus shipping. Awesome. Sometimes these take forever to sell, so I don't want to say, like, go grab every Corky's <laughs> that you see. Um, but, yeah, I don't know if it's just the right season. Somebody just really wanted that blue color. I don't know. Yeah. I was thinking the blue color would make them, um, you know, more, like, not as many people are looking for blue. Right. It's, like, maybe a black or a tan or something. And Kathy did mention our Thursday Night Live. So Kathy does some listing on Thursdays. And this Thursday, we are actually going mm -hmm. to be closing on our new house. Our closing is scheduled. Yes. <laughs> Finally. <Yay. laughs> the Monday before the Thursday we close. <laughs> Although it happened over the weekend. So, <laughs> um, but we went, we did a final walkthrough, checked everything. AC's working. All Everything's working in the house. We're ready to go sign. And so that's what's happening Thursday. It's at two o'clock. Our live is normally at eight, but... I think I think we're just gonna skip out on next week's live or this week's live. Yeah, probably get some. Well, we want to paint the new house. So yeah. Somehow get going on that. We're gonna try to hit the ground that, running. Then yeah. Yeah. Just move some stuff over that we don't need. Then yeah. So unfortunately, we'll miss you guys this Thursday. <laughs> just for one week. Just for one week, and we're probably gonna be mm -hmm. spending the next couple lives after that at our old house so yeah. getting we're going to be getting that house ready to rent mm -hmm. but that's going to take some time and i think moving the whole office that'll be like the last it'll probably part. be the very last thing that we do so, so we'll be living tight. between two places <laughs> for a while <laughs> yes and fixing them both up yeah. <laughs> so yeah all right i finally sold these hotter comfort concept sandals i've had these probably for two plus years i did pay ten dollars for them and finally sold them for 17 with discount shipping so I'm making like a dollar, but I'm very happy to get my $10 back out of those. Yeah. 
I don't know. I probably won't pick up this brand much anymore. Maybe at the bins or something. Mm -hmm. Definitely not for $10. Sometimes it sells for $30. It usually takes forever, no matter how much it sells for. So yeah. do what you wish with that information. <laughs> um, I don't know. I feel like it's a really nice leather quality sandal or shoe, um, but it just never seems to do super well. Yeah. a brand i love though i don't know how you say it but it's like obos or o yeah okay. obos um yeah normally i find like the hiking boots or like a more not quality sandal but like a more substantial sandal this is like a flip-flop mm. uh these ones i paid five sold for 30 plus ship but like the boots and stuff you can get 50 60 okay sometimes so bolo obos i'll put the brand uh yeah. here on the screen so you can get a closer look all right this is just something i was Ready to let go of and sent a pretty low offer. Some little baby Nike shoes. I bought them at Once Upon a Child for $6.80. Finally sold for six, no, seventeen with discount shipping. So like, I don't know, a few dollars profit, but yeah. not much. But I've had them for over six months. I like little like kid Nikes, but under size like five seems to just take a while. And yeah. Not, I don't know. I used to be able to get like twenty, but not really anymore. these new balance for 23 plus ship on mercari i bought them for five very nice yeah. Ooh, we got a viewer sale going out to zach a bundle so ap and b c right here all right um <laughs> Zach got this shirt that I forgot what it is. Oh, that's uh, from Castlevania. Okay. So it's a, a loot crate. No, it's a, it's a video a game. game. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> he had to tell me for her when I listed it. But yeah. yeah. This is one of Chris's shirts that I had bought him from Goodwill. Still not knowing what it was. Right. But anyways, so I think I have about $3 into that. You might have worn it. I don't even know if you wore it. And then the socks from our recent bins haul. Um, so Zach bought these two items for... Seventeen sixty-five plus ship. I have less than six dollars into both of them. So awesome! Thank you, Zach. Zach, thank you so much for <laughs> all of the amazing support. We yeah. appreciate you so much. So much. Sorry, we're not going to be live this Thursday, yeah. <laughs> but we'll uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Yeah. some bionic sandals these took forever to sell for some reason like just about a year bionic sandals normally sell super fast so yeah. i don't know what was up i thought these were in really good shape and a nice looking one and yeah anyways i paid 6.99 for them finally sold for 29.42 plus ship so still some decent profit but i don't know i have noticed bionics have been selling a little bit lower yeah. more like 30 than 40 i used to be able to get 40 pretty easily but I still like them. They generally sell fast. Um, and people seem to sell I mean, like there's them. always that outlier, yeah. you know, like they could still sell generally fast. There's just the one, you know, and it was that one. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think those were like a women's six. So, uh, you know, yeah. I always say those smaller sizes take a while. We could have even like relisted at some point. Yeah. It might have sold faster. But yeah, yeah, just how it was. Um, these are Mossman Australia swim chunks. Bought retail arbitrage for $8.92, sold for $26.66 plus ship. AK. Right there. Yeah, pretty new listing, some Crocs. These are like called the Patricia sandal. I bought for $10. They sold for my full list price on Posh of $44. Pretty cool. crazy for some yeah. Crocs. Yeah. Yeah. Crocs are out selling Vionics, yeah. huh? <laughs> All right, another viewer sale bundle going out to Stephanie. So BZ. Probably right down behind you. And then EA, which I'm gonna go, or where is it? It's right here. Okay. Should I? This, it's a pair of jeans, yeah, those jeans. These, these jeans? All right. See guys, I help, I help too. <laughs> 
<laughs> Stephanie got these two pair of pants, uh, both seven brand um, jeans and some camo pants. I got them both from the bin, so my cost for both was four dollars twelve cents. Stephanie offered twenty four for the bundle, so thank you awesome. so much. Stephanie, they thank you so much. Work out for you. Yeah. She said she was very much in need of some new pants. So sweet. Yeah. Glad we're here for you. We appreciate you so much. <laughs> um. Okay. So now. Because I separated my labels. I'm, I have some random shoes that are either here or there, and then I'll be on that side okay. after. So, area, fat baby boots. Yeah, I was gonna say, I think these are here. Do you wanna get them or I'll get them, yeah. Them? Okay. They're these, like, embroidered ones. With the pink? Yeah. Oh, I remember these. Always put these really tight. <laughs> I had to fit more, but I'm getting rid of a few today, so let's get. Um, yeah, so these are really good shape. I paid $20 for these at a thrift, but I accepted a $52 offer. Honestly, probably could have got more if I held out, but when I spend 20, I like to get that back kind of quickly and yeah. I doubled my money. So I was happy with that. Alrighty, um, shoe shelf, Irish sweater. These have been listed a while. This I like this brand, Irish Setter. I think it's like um, a sub-brand or something of a Red Wing. Oh, okay. But yeah, they, they usually do pretty well. These were a smaller men's size, so they took a little longer, but sold for $47 with discount shipping on Posh. I bought for $9.99, so. Neat. Nice little sale. Oh, I don't need to do that. Shoe shop again. Can't see you. Men's Keen leather low top. Bought for 15, sold for 44 with discount shipping. It's so probably right. a little over doubling there. Good to see these big boots get out of here. <laughs> I was getting, you can see, pretty full up here, up here, up yeah. here. Another pair on here. Yeah, I think that was about all the space. What we did was we consolidated, we turned one shoe around on all of these, and that really added a lot I of was space. Able to fit, yeah, like yeah. three extra pairs, so. Yeah, Which so. Which doesn't sound like a lot, but I was literally <laughs> at the max, so. Sold some Keen snow boots. I did pay $15 for these kind of at the end of winter. Um, so I accepted a $30 off round posh. So what is that? I'm making 24. So yeah, only like eight, $9 profit, but hey. Yeah. It's not too bad. Alrighty. Um, baskets, this. Yeah, so this was in our recent bins haul. Oh, uh, you sold the giraffe. Not Teddy Bear Co. Giraffe. I bought Obviously, hit the bins. Two forty-three cost of goods into fifteen plus ship. So hey, not bad. Yeah, really fast though. He's cute. <laughs> okay, now I'm gonna head to the other side. All right. <laughs> All right. H E. Here. All right. We sold the cow hay dudes last week. Now we sold these corkies. So it's corkies with a C, so it's not like the same as the cork. E's. Right. <laughs> so, so yeah. So K-O-R-K-E-A-S-E, and then these are C-O-R-K-Y-S. So That's corkies, confusing. I know. <laughs> Two very um, different brands. Yeah, generally I would say this brand is not one to pick up. I only picked these up because they were the cow. The and cow. I knew That's because awesome. I had I had the hey dudes, yeah, that the cow was something that people like, I guess. Um, so anyways, I bought these for $7.99, sold for $44 with discount shipping on Posh. Hey. Pretty good. Yeah. Okay, GY. Little vintage baby girl dress, bought at the bins, $2.58. The brand is Hugs and Kisses. I don't know that that necessarily matters, but yeah. these little frilly, lacy vintage dresses usually at least you can usually get 20. So this one I got 26.66 plus ship. So All right. yeah, if I find them at Goodwill for a buck or two or at the bins, obviously I will grab them. All right, and then these Skechers like Y2K shoes, bought for 12.99, sold for 39.55 plus ship. Yeah, the Skechers Y2K, I yeah. guess is still, still going. <laughs> All right, GV, I think this is Skechers Blue. Black. I bought these for eleven fifty, sold for twenty eight plus ship, so probably about doubling my money there. F Y. Franco Sardo sandals, bought for six ninety nine, sold for twenty six sixty six plus ship. Sweet. 
HM. These are a pair of Clark, so just some blue with perforated wedges. Bought for eight fifty, sold for thirty one eleven plus ship. Wow. It's like we sold a lot of blue shoes yeah. this weekend. <laughs> yeah, normally I sometimes pass on things based on like color. Thinking, yeah. You know, I don't want to hold it for a while, but maybe I shouldn't do that. Uh, sold some Nike Youth size sneakers. Bought for ten, sold for twenty six with discount shipping. So probably just like a nine dollar profit or so, but not too bad. F J. I think it's over here. This is the brand Atrex. These are the Mimi sandal. Um, bought these for $6. Sold for $30 with discount shipping on Pop. Not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> GZ. These are like the reggae sandal. Bought for $9.99, sold for $30 on Posh. Okay, EH. Okay, Wrangler Pearl Snap Flannel. Bought for $4.99, sold for $20. That was an offer someone sent. I accepted. And Posh. Nice. GW. Is Maurice's um, a top? I bought this for myself, but I bought it from Goodwill for five bucks. I never wore it. Obviously, it's still new at Tag. Sold it for nineteen plus shipping, so making a little profit there. Okay, I love when you buy something for yourself and make a little profit, you know. <laughs> yeah. It's not I never wore it. Like I always like go to Goodwill, buy myself stuff, and then I wear the same like three outfits. Like, <laughs> <every week. laughs> so. Meryl. Meryl sandals. Um, I think we bought. Where did we go? Vegas. I think I bought these in Vegas at a Savers. Oh. For eight fifty, sold for twenty six sixty six plus ship. Sweet. G H. H. Mountain Hardware men shorts. I bought for four dollars. Accepted an eighteen dollar offer. Definitely probably could have got like 25 or so out of those, but yeah, I was accepting offers this weekend pretty much on anything. <laughs> yeah. All right. F -F. I did decline a few offers, like <laughs> $10 on $40 listing type stuff, but right. if I was making around $10 or so, I was pretty happy with that. Um, so these Sperry for my fullest price of $39, I bought them for $7.50, so... These are like a women's 12. I don't know if that means. I feel like Sperry's usually take a while to sell and those ones didn't. So I'm assuming maybe it's because of the size. Yeah. It's a neat colorway too. Yeah. I guess these bright colors. Maybe it's just because it's summer. Like, summer? Yeah. HL. I'm the kind of person that has like one black shoe and one white shoe because <laughs> it pretty much matches with like anything. So. Well, you have other shoes, but you always pick them. Yeah. <laughs> like, like with this shirt, you always are like, I want to be adventurous and try these blue shoes. Wait, and then you never convince yourself to wear it. Yeah. <laughs> All right. This was a good sale. Um, I did pay a lot for these, though. Oh. So these are Freebirds. Free bird. Really nice. Like, look, they're basically brand new. But I paid $50 for them at a local thrift here. And I accepted $120 on Posh. So I make like $96. So like a $45 profit or so on those. Not yeah. That's not I was bad hoping at all. to about double my money, but yeah, even honestly, I would pay fifty to probably make twenty because those usually sell so fast. Right. So yeah. So what do you guys think? Would you have spent fifty bucks on <laughs> the like new yeah. Freebirds? I mean, I was confident I could at least get a hundred on them. So. All right, E K. Another pair of Keen snow boots. Um, these ones were actually my son's. I bought them at Once Upon a Child, though, for 12. He actually wore them, and I sold them for 29 plus ship. Nice. So still more than double in what I paid for them. Okay. Right. 
These are some sass. These are called like the Gretchen boot. I bought for $11.89, sold for $53.36 plus ship really fast, like within a week or so. So yeah. Awesome. Pretty good weekend. That is a, yeah, that's quite a bit of stuff. I'll give you the last rundown of it. <laughs> so sweet. We do have to get the stuff home and pack it all up, yeah. take it off to the post office. So I think we're gonna go do that. Maybe get a coffee on the way home. <laughs> But yeah, that's what I sold over the weekend. Like I mentioned in the beginning, this is going to be a busy week, but I think we have enough time to do some other videos. Kathy went yeah. to the bins yesterday, right? I did. They're just, it was Sunday. They closed at six. I didn't get down there till like four. Yeah. Um, and like, that means they, if they close at six, they usually stop putting out new stuff at five, like right. an hour before. So I really only had an hour. So I, you know, I spent like 30 bucks, which means I hardly got anything. Right. So I, I think there's one go. thing that you might have got that was really good. It we'll was to, a cool thing. We yeah. have to so look I, into it. I definitely it. want to do a haul, but yeah. I kind of want to go one more time and then make it like a double haul, I guess, because, yeah. yeah, the haul that I have is not even like a five minute video, probably. Right. <laughs> right. Um, so, so yeah. what do you guys think? Should Kathy go back to the bins? and yes. find some more stuff let us know in the comments but so we, we're probably going to do that later in the week and probably even another what's sold yeah. make up for not being able to do a live on thursday so anyway guys we're going to get going on all that thank you so much for watching thanks for all the viewer support today we do appreciate you guys very much and i can't wait to show you guys the new house so we'll see you guys next time bye, bye.